Hi everyone. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to run quick uh, dimmer bounce effect across your fixtures using a new simplified pixel mapper. So first of all, what you need to do is, like I'm using just the basic um, training file, the demo file. Um, so I had 12 Maverick MK2 spots. They were, so I need to make sure that, um, so if you look here, sorry, they all go in one line. So I need to make sure that if I want to achieve that bounce effect, dimmer bounce effect across them all, I need to make sure that the, the desk thinks they all go in one line. To do this, I need to select my group, press view grid, and that will show me, sorry, this here, view grid. It shows me that it has all 12 fixtures in one line. If it's not the case, you press set grid size, type in the amount of, um, type in the amount of uh, fixtures you have uh, horizontally. So it's a width, so I type 12. Uh, and then uh, backslash one means uh, vertically is only one fixture, so they all go in a row. And after that, I select my spots, I press add effect, pixel map, and the one says line vertical. And then you say I wanted to run across intensity. So again, this uh, effect can apply on any attribute. But in my case, I'm just running on intensity. And you can see that uh, the fixtures, uh, it's like a dimmer effect you have. It's a dimmer chase, goes from left to right, but the direction here gives you bounce. So if you press bounce, you can see easily bounce. So you don't need to create any more Q stacks or chases that does that. So this is gonna be the case for you. Or if you wanna go bounce in the center and out, you press here, it says centering, it's like centering bounce. Do it like this. With this um, with this pixel mapping, uh, you can control here the effects width. So you can control how wide your effect is gonna be. And you can control, of course, your size of the effect, and you can control the speed of the effect as well. So again, hope that was helpful for you. So you don't need to now create any overcomplicated cues and uh, cue stacks to, to make a simple dimmer bounce effect. And of course, if you wanna record anything, you just press record, click here. So you recorded your effect. Now you can raise your effect and it works as it should be. That's all for today. I hope it was useful. Thank you very much and have a good day. Bye.